Hey everyone, I'm super excited to uh, explore something really special with you today. Another sneak peek at the stunning giant panda from the wildlife creations that Popo brought to life in 2023. We'll inspect it up close like never before. By the way, if you enjoy what you see here, I truly appreciate your support. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button, give us a like, and don't forget to share this with your friends. Thank you so much in advance. After eagerly anticipating and tirelessly scouring various sites for this figurine, which had captured my admiration and curiosity long before it landed in my hands, I finally got my hands on it. Um, so let's unwrap this beauty and check it out more closely. So last year in 2023, Popo dropped a bunch of new figures. And let me tell you, this one caught my eye big time. Its unique pose really piqued my interest. This is a great and unique pose unlike anything we've ever come across before. The way it's so lively and dynamic makes you feel the joy this panda feels it eagerly munches away on its food. And as soon as you lay eyes on it, you can't help but notice the top-notch craftsmanship and attention to detail in the sculpture. Looking at it from every angle, this model is incredibly accurate boasting a realistic shape and spot-on anatomical structure. The color scheme also sets this figure apart. And this time, they've gone for a semi-sitting position with the body slightly lifted upwards. Now, let's really take a look and get a good grasp of its size by comparing it to uh, the other models. We have here the 2016 version, and here's the retired, like 2012 and also the retired like 2017. Check this out, folks. This figure stands out from the rest in three major ways. Its unique posture, the way it's holding that bamboo branch, and the raised right arm interacting with it. This piece really holds its own in terms of competitiveness, and its size falls right in line with other brands. Um, so let's zoom in and examine it up close. The skin and texture of this figurine are incredibly realistic, featuring intricate details that make it truly stand out. They've nailed the fur layers, making them look incredibly realistic with a wavy texture that perfectly matches the folds of the abdomen. The fur details are incredibly intricate, and you can see how they're delicately waved in a consistent flow downwards. The way its knees are positioned crouched down like that really accentuates the thigh muscles and they've managed to maintain the fur details flawlessly. And what's really cool is how that position reflects in the lower back, giving it this realistic elongated shape. Absolutely, I'm blown away by the fur details around the abdomen and hips area. They really captured that beloved chubby body of the panda perfectly. The detail on the back is just astounding. They've actually added some lighter fur, kind of spreading out from the middle of the back towards the sides. It just amps up the realism and makes the pose even more beautiful. Yeah, that sitting position really gives the figure a unique presence, doesn't it? And let's not forget about the color schemes. They're not just beautiful, but also really consistent and spot on. Now, let's shift our focus to the bamboo branch. It's of good quality in positioning it like this was a great idea. You can really see how busy the panda is munching away on it, which adds a realistic touch. Oh, it looks like the branch is removable. Hmm. And the way he, he holds onto that branch really highlights the special attention to detail they put into the design. Uh, speaking of the head, I gotta say, they, they really nailed it this time. It's perfectly proportioned to the body and scientifically accurate. And showing off those fur details was a nice touch too. All the dimensions of the head seem spot on and the colors look just right too. They really paid attention to getting everything just perfect. The eyes really stand out, 
mm, shiny and well colored and you can almost feel the, like panda's determination as it munches on those bamboo leaves and they've nailed the details perfectly let's talk about that right arm for a sec i'm loving the design here yeah, it's reaching forward and upward perfectly mirroring the panda's busy mealtime posture it's like they captured the moment flawlessly the fur details are spot on and the paint job is clean too and they've really paid attention to the details of the palm here. Check out those claws clearly defined and sculpted to perfection and realistic colors too. And let's not forget about the quality of the plastic they've used. It's top notch. You can really feel the difference. I don't see any flaws in the paint job or in the texture or the shape. Every detail is flawlessly executed with precision. Guys, overall, this model is just beyond a wonderful. It's so realistic and stands out from other versions. Plus it's shaken off that usual routine of, of generic shapes and you know childish details. It's a, it's a real game changer. And this model isn't just gonna bring joy to children. It's also gonna put a big smile on our faces and add a touch of beauty and distinction to our shelves as collectors. All right, guys, thanks a bunch for watching, and I trust you enjoyed this review and it gave you a solid understanding of the figure, but I really appreciate your strong support for the channel. So let's team up to bring you more top-notch content that it's the mark for you. Thanks once more and catch you in the next episode.